Hi, my name is Kamila Novak Choi, and I'm an assistant professor at the Radiation Oncology Department at the University of Maryland School of Medicine. Uh, I practice primarily at Upper Chesapeake in Harford County, as well as downtown at the Medical Center and the Proton Center. Uh, I take care of all sorts of patients. I have a special interest in women's cancers, uh, including breast and GYN malignancies. When I was a medical student, I did a rotation in radiation oncology. I was very interested in the connection between patient care and the technological cutting edge aspect of radiation oncology. I also enjoyed how multidisciplinary it is and how different specialties come in to work together. My practice philosophy is really centered on uh, multidisciplinary patient-centered care. I think it's very important to take into consideration patients' values and preferences and make sure that we provide them as a team all of the necessary tools to make the decision that's, in, that's the right one for them. I think we have moved away from the paternalistic approach where the doctor tells you what to do. I think it's important that the patient feels that they're in charge of their care and that we are part of their team and we're there to support them. You know, nowadays, medicine, oncology, it's so much more than just the treatment. The treatments can be difficult, so it's our job to explain to them what they entail and as well as support them throughout the treatment. I love how I can provide care for patients right in their community at the Chesapeake. We have, you know, all the latest technologies uh, for the treatments, but for certain more specialized treatments, such as certain GYM procedures, or for patients who require uh, protons for their treatment, we have that connection where I can seamlessly transition them uh, to the medical center or the proton center. Uh, and patients, I think, are very appreciative of the fact that they don't have to travel. They can stay right in their community, but get the same level of care as well as access to clinical trials.